Okay guys, so what are we going to do today? Um, we're gonna go from this to this. A bit classier than our antique nozzle coming straight from the 80s, right? already replaced the nozzles with some uh, three jets or four jets, eight jets, 19 jets, whatever. Still crap, no? What you think? Don't agree? Want me to explain? Okay, come on. Okay, so I'll explain to you. So basically, what are we going to do? We are simply going to replace the nozzles with uh, other nozzles. We are going to use Volvo uh, nozzles. They are called mist nozzles. Many other brands are using the same kind of nozzle, but we know for a fact that uh, the Volvo ones with the following reference are plug and play for our cars. You really, really must purchase genuine OEM Volvo nozzles. Don't buy copies. I bought copies especially to show you the differences. Look at the plastic quality difference. Look at the clips difference, look at how it holds to the hood. And last but not least, look at the jets. There really is no comparison. Everyone I know of who purchased copies had the same issues. So really, really, really purchase OEM genuine Volvo parts. It's really important. So we would, won't go into too much details. It's pretty straightforward. Pop your hood. And then you have two washers, one here, one there. Just pull the hose, be careful not to pull too hard. And when it's done, using a flat screwdriver, you'll just push on the pin, push on the second pin if needed, and the nozzle should, should pop off easily. As you can see, comparing the old nozzle with the new nozzle, the old one has a pin in front and in back, and the Volvo one has a pin on each side. So when you're installing the new nozzle, do not push it straight as it will be too hard and you will break a clip for sure. The technique is very easy. You just put it sideways at a 90 degree angle and then you just turn it so it faces the, the windshield. You put the hose back on, then you do the same on the other side. Pull the hose, push the pins, install the new nozzle. You put the hoods back on, close the hood, and you're done. Little tip, if the nozzle sprays a bit out of the windshield, you can always turn it a bit more on the center, so it sprays perfectly on all the windshield. That's all, folks. I hope you enjoyed the video, and I'll see you at the next episode. Ciao!